Hi everyone and welcome to today's Kids Cooking Corner. Today we are making arts and crackers. Now kids can have some fun with some cookie cutters and a tasty fruit topping that turns a simple cheese and crackers into a great treat that kids will love and adults would love it too. So what you will need are slices of cheese of your choice and today I'm using the Colby Jack cheese. One apple peeled and chopped, a tablespoon of butter, two tablespoons of preserves of your choice. Now today I am using apricot preserves. And a fourth teaspoon of ground cinnamon, crackers of your choice, and these are just whole wheat crackers. And assorted cookie cutters. I have just a star today, but whatever you have, you can make even Christmas ornaments for Christmas in July as a treat or whatever you have available. So the first thing you want to do is you want to cut your cheese slices with assorted cookie cutters and set aside. So I have my Colby Jack cheese. And I'm just going to press my cookie cutter into the cheese, like so. Like I said, the kids will have a lot of fun with this. And you can save your leftover cheese for a grilled cheese sandwich or and just pop your cheese ornament out of your cookie cutter. And I already started this, but in a small skillet, you want to saute your chopped apple in butter. And then you want to add the two tablespoons of preserves and a cinnamon, and you heat that through. And I already have that done. And this really smells good. Like I said, this is the apricot preserves with the chopped apple and the cinnamon in it. Like I said, the smell is just, oh, it's so good. So then when you place your piece of cheese on your cracker, we'll do three more crackers. We'll put a preserve, a preserve one. I'm gonna cut two more. beginning of my crackers with the cheese on top. And then I'll go get my preserve, preserve mixture. And what you want to do is just spoon some over each cheese and crackers. That's what the mixture looks like again. And I only chopped a half an apple up because I was only making four crackers. So this is still the two tablespoons of preserves and the cinnamon, but you'd have a nicer mixture of the apples for more crackers if you want to make some more. something that you can make even for a quick breakfast or a brunch for the kids but it would be, have to probably be something that we'd have to eat you might be able to refrigerate them after they're if you have some left over but they look really cute and fun and then there's our finished product 
So I hope you get a chance to try this recipe with the kids. Until next time, bye-bye.